So this painting is about Heavenly Lake, which is an actual place in the Chiang Mai Mountains. And it's the origin myth of the Manchu dynasty that founded the Qing Empire. And um, it's uh, sort of by its sides is uh, Mount uh, Sinai and Mount Song, two of the holy mountains of uh, uh, the West and uh, of China. And then below here is the cityscape of uh, Tianjin, and uh, it's um, literally translated as uh, heaven's boundary. And so what you have is a timeline of the origin of the Qing Empire through to essentially the eventual downfall of the Qing Empire, where they signed the unfair treaties um, uh, of the Opium Wars uh, that in the second one was conducted by the British and the French. So what, what you can see here is uh, the uh, images that have been printed directly onto the stock listings of the Financial Times. And uh, for me, the stock listings represents this sort of uh, new world of data, a datascape, an information space on a global scale. And I compressed um, these kind of ancestral um, mythologies with a contemporary landscape to talk about in some ways about the, the timeline of our uh, humanity expressed through uh, the rise and falls of uh, civilizations. And so of course here it's depicting the origins of the Qing Empire with the Manchu dynasty and uh, through to modern day China with Tianjin, which is like the fifth largest city in terms of GDP. Here it's also depicted or constructed through piping of acrylic covered in sand, spray painted from different directions to create this kind of moonscape uh, of, a, of a landscape. And the sand for me becomes a metaphor uh, of uh, the poetic uh, existentialism of uh, civilization itself. I think of uh, Ozymandias, uh, the poem by Percy uh, Shelley, and uh, this idea that all civilizations eventually, you know, despite their grandeur, crumble to sand.